I just want to give you a quick idea of what happens with uh, our review campaign. So you provide us with first name, last name, and an email address. What I do is I plug it into our reputation management CRM. And so an individual will see receive the first email and it says, hi, first name, we really value your opinion as a client of Professionals Rockingham. Our real estate management team works very hard to make sure that we deliver great customer service. It would mean a lot to myself and our team to get feedback on your experience. At our team meetings, we share the reviews and feedback we get from valued clients like you. We'd love to hear about your experience with us. It would really make a difference and be greatly appreciated. If there's anything else we can do for you, your family, or people you care about, please contact us. I look forward to personally reading your review. And so in the email, it has two options. One big orange call to action that says, leave us feedback. And then another, you know, slight touch one that just says, click here to leave us a review. And so this is going to be coming from Craig. All these emails are going to be coming from Craig. And let me show you what our feedback page looks like. All right, so this is what the email is going to look like here in your inbox, just to give you an example. And then when somebody clicks to leave us, to leave you feedback, it's going to go to what we call a would you recommend us page. So we need their permission in order to move forward. That is why we have a yes and a no. And so when an individual clicks yes, it's going to give some options. So thanks for giving us feedback. Next step, click on a local directory, which is either Google or Facebook below to leave your review online. So when an individual clicks on Google, it takes them straight to what we call the Google Naked link, because this goes straight to the rate us and review us box so that they immediately click on the five stars, share their details and add a photo and click post. Say, um, now Facebook isn't really the same way because they've got a little bit of some different rules. So Facebook, when an individual clicks on Facebook, it goes straight to um, the review page. So then that person can take action and write a review from here. So let's say an individual says, leave, leave us a feedback. But then when they go here, they had a bad experience and they say, no, I really don't want to leave, you know, feedback. What happens is we're apologizing. And so it, it goes to this page and it says, how can we pr improve? So then an individual will fill out what happened that was unsatisfactory or you know some suggestions on how we can do it better so this won't happen again. And then they'll click this button and it goes send straight to the manager who would be Craig. And Craig would receive this, e this message in his inbox so then that he can reply to the individual that is making their um, complaint or suggestion on improvements. And that information will not go live on Google or Facebook. That is something that we can have a conversation offline with and correct offline. So if you have any questions in regards to this um, review campaign, please let me know.